Thanks for coming back. Okay, we're progressing on up the body. We learned how the knees um, flex and extend to manage pressures and um, as we move in skiing. So the hip joint, I'm gonna do the same thing. We're doing this um, articulating the feet and the knees. We're steering our feet, we're tipping our feet, and we max them and we're gonna tip the feet the other way maxing them out with their weight on the outside, nose over the outside foot. And then what I wanna do is draw the abdominals up tight. Draw the abdominals up as we, so we're not just lifting with the hip flexors, we're actually trying to pull and raise and bring this hip forward, okay, on the bench. And then we're gonna press down. And as we push down on this side, we're actually gonna move this knee forward. Okay, by the abdominal action, action in the abdominals. So right here is where abdominals needs to draw, keep you pulling down the hill. Right there, drawing the abdominals, working just the hip flexors. And then as we come across here, we're gonna push down on the chair, pull back, back, and forward with this hip. Okay, so we're just taking a little bit more extreme and we're using the abdominals, the groin muscles, we're pulling back on the right side and we're getting this lead, this left side in front to go left. Coming around, drawing up these abdominals, drawn, drawn, staying over the outside foot, weights on the thigh of the left leg as we're pointing things to the right. Push, push, steer those feet all the way to the max. Hang with me. And then as you change, you're starting to pressure. Pressure the right. Your weight shifted over to the right side of the bench. And this left side is drawing and moving forward. A lot of movement in the abdominals right here, making this happen in the abdominals. So you see your knees changing distance from the from the chair pulling 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 okay so that articulates all the feet work and everything and like it's super super steep drop in